Hi, this is Katie. We're here with Cole and Josh, and we're talking about the Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> me and Cole aren't going to describe ourselves, so we're going to start describe each other. Cole Tully, one of my great friends. I've known him since he was a little jit. And he has two brothers, Troy and Scott. Scott plays baseball at Notre Dame. He's pretty nice with it. Troy, he's just an all-around savage. And Cole has a lovely mother who makes really good food. And, yeah, Cole's just an all-around great guy. Plays basketball at the high school. Also plays baseball at the high school. He's hoping to go D1, you know. He's going to make it big. He's going to make it out the hood. And he gon' he gon' he gon' make some love for his people, you know. Um, I've known Josh since he was young too. Um, Josh is from Mattapan. Spends some time down on Wakefield Street, Reading, Mass. Um, I play basketball with Josh. He plays lacrosse too. He was a lacrosse state champion. Um, favorite clothing brand definitely Tommy Hilfiger. Uh, he's a big fan of Chance the Rapper. Yeah, and last night, uh, Josh made a play on a free throw to save the game and keep our playoff run alive. So, like, shush, 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 shush. So, where were you guys when you watched the Super Bowl? And who did you watch the game with? I was at my house. We, we held the Super Bowl party. And a couple of my neighbors came over. I don't know why, but most mostly my cousins and grandparents and stuff. Yeah, I was also at my house. Uh, a couple of like family friends were there, and then like I had a bunch of my friends over. You know, some popular names: uh, Dan Weston, Cole Voltaggio, the Emrys, Matt Gallagher. That's all I got. What was your predicted outcome originally? Pages won by 60. That's, won that's by all 60. I'm hearing. But they won by 60. But they still won, though, so I'm not, I'm not hearing it. Yeah, I, kn- I knew the Pats were going to win. I thought, we ha- I thought we were looking at Tom Brady, Super Bowl MVP, but it just didn't happen. So, you know. Uh, what, did you guys think uh, what did you guys think with the highlights of it? Um... Kinda passed out in the four first quarter, but highlights is definitely the Patriots winning the Super Bowl. Lowlights is that Tom Brady didn't win MVP. That's definitely what I think is. Yeah, um, I think the highlight was like probably Sonny Michelle. I'm just a big fan of Sonny Michelle, you know. So, um, so I was pretty happy about that, but. Yeah, I don't really know the MVP situation. That was pretty weird. What did you guys think about the whole halftime show situation? Um, I tend to not watch the halftime show because usually it's kind of whack. Unless my girl, BB, well, the queen, she up there. That's the only time I'm watching it. But, yeah, I really didn't watch the halftime performance. I thought the halftime show wasn't very good. Um, I mean, Maroon 5 is like, eh. But, you know, Travis Scott, I'm all right with Travis Scott. I like Outkast. So, yeah, I mean, I would give it like a f- 5 out of 10 at most. What about the score? Were you shocked by the low-scoring defensive nature of the game? Yeah, I was pretty surprised because I really thought, Tom Brady was really about to put up 60 because you know he's the G-O-A-T weird 
Yeah, I was pretty shocked too. I'm going to actually go back to that last question where it says, who would you have rather seen take the stage? And I'm going to tell you right now that I wanted to see Drake take the stage because I think Drake had like a huge year. And um, big Drake fan. Scoring game, that was pretty weird. That, that was weird. I didn't see that coming. It was like the lowest scoring Super Bowl ever. So, yeah. I mean, that's pretty weird. Uh, what are your thoughts on the future pa- Patriots? Do you um, think Gronk and Brady Gronk? will return? Uh, probably not. He's he's kind of banged up. Brady, he ain't leaving until you start losing. I don't think he's going to start losing anytime soon. Yeah, I agree with Josh. I don't think that there's any chance Gronk's coming back. But um, I can see Brady playing for like another three or four years. Who's your favorite Patriot? My favorite Patriot My favorite may Patriot. have to be. Um, might have to say Robert Kraft. I know you don't play, but he seems like a pretty cool dude. <laughs> Chill with the Naughty Joke, cool. Yeah, but Robert Kraft is my guy. I see him in Florida sometimes. I like Matthew Slater. He's my favorite Patriot. And Aaron Hernandez. Uh, did you guys go to the parade? <laughs> no, I couldn't go to the parade because of basketball. And it was kind of rough. It looked like everybody was having mad fun. It was boozing. But I don't booze because I'm a good kid. Yeah, I didn't get to go to the parade either. Um, we were grinding at practice, you know. Georgetown, Kentucky, um, no parade for us. But now we're now we're a playoff game in, so it's like, did I even want to go to the parade? No, he didn't. That's his answer. Well, thanks for sitting down with us today. Good luck this week. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Turbo. Baby, sold out next, cash every day. I got you a maze, a lot of blue rays. Bitch cheating my pet, the condo a K. Her DD did I gotta get laid. My jacket all white, don't mean that it's made. I clean up real nice, I don't got a maze. Her ape in the night, I'm still rocking bait. Live on paradise, I don't see the 